All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome, welcome to our special, special webinar, Bigger, Better Launch. I'd like to welcome everybody here today. You might be wondering, where did this name come from? Well, we're, um, we're getting bigger, we're getting better, and we're doing this through launching some amazing new features and tools. And this is not just a one-time only thing, guys. Every month going forward, we're going to be bringing you these mic drop moments here at Helium 10 because we're helping you guys become better Amazon sellers, better Walmart sellers by listening to your suggestions and all of the things that you guys have been wanting from, from new tools to new features. And every single month going forward, we're going to be bringing these new launches that are bigger and better to you. Um, if you guys haven't met me yet, my name is Bradley Sutton. I'm the director of training here at Helium 10. And I'm joined by my partner in crime here, Carrie Miller. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hi, everyone. I'm Carrie. I'm a brand evangelist here uh, working with Bradley to bring all the best uh, tips and tricks for specifically Walmart, but I'm also an Amazon seller. So I've been in the game for about six years. So definitely excited to be here to talk about all the new tools we have to launch. All right. So now that you guys know us, it's time for you guys to introduce yourselves. So I'll go ahead and put in the uh, chat. Where are you guys watching from? Let's see how many countries we can get. I think the record is like 33 different countries that people have been watching uh, on a webinar. We've got uh, hundreds of people already here. So let, let's, uh, Carrie, check out the oh, chat here. Let, let's see. I uh, saw Poland, see? Germany, Poland? Peru, uh, San Diego, Seattle, Philippines, the UK, Florida, Tennessee. Serbian There's house. so many. There's so many. Vancouver, Portland, Santa Cruz, Canary Islands, Maryland. Puerto Czech Rico, Republic, Minnesota. Cyprus. Oh my gosh. They're going so fast. There's so many. I know, right? Uh, Calgary. Wow. Uh, Austin, Latvia. Latvia. <laughs> That's awesome. So right. I think we might have beat our record of 33 already. Okay. Look at that. Korea, Anyang Haseo. All right. Awesome. All right. So all of you guys are going to get value out of today's announcements. But just, you know, I want to throw up a poll real quick here. Uh, I'm just curious as to where you guys are at in your Amazon journey. All right. You know, have, have you never sold on Amazon before? Um, or maybe you're brand new to Amazon. You, you've launched in the last year. Or perhaps you've been selling for maybe over a year. Or you are a seasoned veteran. Been selling uh, well over a year. All right. What do we see here? We got... Um... A lot of people who've been newbies. selling. We got some newbies. Yeah, I like it. That, that, that's the beauty about today, guys, because whenever we, we try and launch things or try and improve things, we always want to have in mind a broad audience. We don't want to make it just for the seven-figure sellers or, oh, no, this is only for newbies who can, who can benefit from this. We really want to be able to benefit everybody. So no matter what you guys just selected here, you guys are going to get value. So it looks like the Never sold on Amazon before is, is a big uh, a big group here. So that's awesome. You guys are going to love what we're going to share today. All right, one more question now. Um, let's go ahead and ask you guys how many of you are Helium 10 users. And again, regardless of what your answer is here, you're going to get value uh, today out of what we're going to talk about. So maybe you're brand new to the community. You, you don't even have a free membership. You know, um, Go ahead and put that there. Or maybe you have a free Helium 10 account. Um, maybe you have a platinum, which is probably the majority here, or maybe you're a diamond elite, or you have an enterprise account. Go ahead and select what applies to you there in the poll. What do you see there, Carrie? I'm not seeing the poll right now. You don't see the poll? Oh, okay. I've there you seen, go. I can't actually, sorry, here, here diamond go. and above. Ah, got a lot of platinums. A lot of platinum. That's what I uh, would have uh, expected. All right. Awesome. I see Joe ans asking a question in the chat. Is this live or record? Yes, we are live, uh, Joe. Uh, if you're watching, you might be watching this on the replay, but uh, everybody who's uh, on right now, you guys are, we are live. Jake says, no, what? No elite option? <laughs> Jake says, Jake's what? No. That is diamond <laughs> and above, Jake Paulson. <laughs> Leave it to Jake to always try, uh, try and uh, mess things up here. <laughs> All right, awesome. All right, let's go ahead and end that poll, uh, Gio. Uh, we got a good idea. Again, no matter what you uh, answered in the last couple of questions, you guys are going to find value in what we are talking about um, today. All right. We, as always, we love giving out you know prizes and and swag and things. So, so Carrie, what, what can they do if they want to get a little something, something from Cassandra from our social oh, media team? Uh, so this is really fun. I love seeing everyone who's watching. So what you're going to do is you're going to take a selfie of yourself like Bradley's doing right now. 
uh, take a selfie of yourself watching a webinar and post it to your Instagram story and tag at Helium 10 software. And we'll share those. And if you do this, you have, you're going to be entered to win some Helium 10 swag. So definitely do this. We love to see everyone who's watching and where you're from and just, your, you know, where you're at watching the webinar. We've seen some people in coffee shops and in random places, uh, you know, watching, and we love to see that. So definitely share and you can be entered to win. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Uh, another thing, guys, you know, we, we're going to talk some strategy today because everything that we're launching today is going to help you, like I said, become better entrepreneurs, become better Amazon sellers, better Walmart sellers. And so if that's of interest to you, you must be somebody who likes learning new strategies. So another thing I want you guys to download really quick, I don't want you listening to it right now because you'll be distracted, but, but download it now so that as soon as this webinar is over, you can just go ahead and continue on with your education is, is go to the Serious Sellers Podcast. This will be on your Apple uh, podcast app or your Spotify app, whatever you listen to on your podcast on, on your phone, and then look for episode number 346. It was just launched this week. It's a one hour kind of masterclass on operations and analytics. You know, sometimes that's kind of like the unsexy part of Amazon. Most people have a lot of fun doing product research and keyword research and stuff like that, which are great, but analytics and operations are super important to the lifeblood of your Amazon or Walmart business. So go find uh, that podcast episode right now on your phone and then just hit the download button or just put play and then put pause and then listen to that right after this. And you guys will have like a, now a full two hour strategy filled session. All right. And if you, you guys are uh, German or Spanish speakers, when you type in serious sellers podcast, we also have versions of that podcast in those languages. You can download an episode there as well. Uh, Galaxy S9 says, you need to change your name on Zoom, buddy. But Galaxy S9 <laughs> says, what episode again, please? Uh, that's episode 346. That's the one that's about the operations and analytics. All right. I, I see a lot of like cool um, thoughts here. Everybody uh, understands that I, I had a medical emergency uh, three weeks ago where I kind of died for 10 minutes. I uh, had a heart attack and uh, brought back to a life by wife and paramedics. So thank you for the thoughts and that you guys are putting in the chat. You know, people ask like, oh, did you see a bright light, Bradley, or, or something when, when you were under, or, or did you go to the next place? I'm like, no. But what happened when I was dead was I was like, we're about to launch some amazing things in three weeks. I better come back to life because I got to share this with the audience. So that's why I'm here today, guys. Uh, thanks to uh, Helium 10. Save my life because I knew I had to bring this stuff to you guys. So that's why I'm here. All right. I got a, I got a quiz now for you guys, a pop quiz. All right. For you who said you were Helium 10 members for a while, you guys should know the answer to this. You guys have been using Cerebro, right? All right. What is step 1A of doing keyword research? In other words, how do you find the most important keywords to a niche? All right. Who can tell me in the chat here? What, how have you guys been finding your most important keywords? Carrie, why don't you help us out there? What, All right. What's, um, what's that first step? What I usually do is I go to Amazon and I find my top competitors. I'll do maybe 15 to 20. You can do 10 to 15, um, kind of a good range of competitors. And you, you basically determine that. I usually look at, you know, who's selling the most, because if they're selling the most, they're definitely doing something right. So I look for the highest revenue in my niche, same price, kind of similar product. Everything's pretty, pretty similar. And then I take those ASINs and do a reverse ASIN in Cerebro. Yep. And then once we find all the keywords, there's thousands and thousands of keywords and you have to narrow it down. So usually what I like to do is look for the keywords with what they have in common. So that's usually how I find the most important keywords. Cause usually maybe, you know, three fourths of the competitors are going to have those keywords mm -hmm. or they're going to be indexing and ranking for those keywords. So those, the, that's usually how I find them. Yeah. And, and guys, that, Helium 10 was the first one to develop this method, you know, three years ago when we first launched Cerebro of, of doing this. And um, it's, it's amazing. Like th th this is just mind blowing that you can do this kind of technique. But as Carrie said, it, it takes like a multiple steps. You know, you, you got to find first, get, you know, get the products and then you use the filter, the competitor uh, filter, then you use the search volume filter and then you start narrowing down. Guess what guys, here's our very first launch of the day introducing the Cerebro one-click filters. This is now live. If you guys have a platinum account or higher, this is already live as of this morning in your accounts. And basically what this is, as you can see here in the yellow, you just hit this one button, top keywords, then boom goes the dynamite. You have got all of what Carrie just said, even 
faster than it took her to even say it, let alone do it. So instead of having to go through 17 different filters to really narrow it down to those top 100 keywords that are really driving the sales to a niche, you can do that now with one click. And I did this with a collagen peptide gummy bear search right here. And with just one click, I got the top keywords here. And you can see here, I have highlighted the competitor performance score. This is not new. This has been here in Helium 10 for a while, but wh why does this have a high score? And like, how did this come up? Well, the reason why these have a 10 out of 10 is because as you can see here, out of all these collagen gummies that I put here, all seven of them are ranking for it. And not only that, their competitor rank average is 11. What does that mean? That means that if you were to look at where they're showing up in the search results, for uh, this keyword here, collagen gummies for women, for example, their average position is not only on page one, but they're on the top half of page one. So obviously that is one of the most, if not the most important keyword for this niche. And again, you could you could always get this information in Helium 10, but it just takes a little bit of extra work because you have to go in and filter. Now you guys can do it in one click, all right? Now let, let's keep going with the quizzes here. That's step 1A for you Cerebro veterans. What do we teach in that learn button as far as step 1B of keyword research? So step 1A is, hey, find those top 10 to 15 keywords that kind of as a whole are driving the sales to multiple competitors, if not all of the main competitors in a niche. But there are some opportunity keywords that a lot of competitors have missed. All right. How do you find that? Carrie, how, how would you have uh, found that? I usually look at the, um, you know, when you see the ranking competitors, you saw, you know, seven out of seven competitors were ranking for all those other keywords. Then uh, the opposite would be to look at some that maybe they're not all ranking for maybe two or three or four are ranking for those keywords. So that's usually what I take a look at to see the opportunity keywords there. Exactly. Uh, this is this was a more recent uh, addition. It's about a year and a half or two years ago, actually, when we launched this part, but it's the advanced filters inside of Cerebro where you can say, hey, show me a minimum or maximum number of products out of this seven or 10 or however many I put there. Usually you want to put like minimum one, maximum two, but are ranking in a certain section. I like personally doing the top 10 and you're going to get keywords that didn't come up in that first, that step 1A. And the reason is because we are looking for keywords that maybe only one or two of your main competitors are crushing it on, but the rest of the competitors, they either don't even have it in their listing or they're not performing well, not getting sales at all. And these we like to call opportunity keywords because instead of having to compete with every single one of your main competitors for these keywords, you're only competing with like one or two top sellers for it, all right? So again, one click filter. Instead of having to do 17 filters and it takes like three or four minutes to get through, you just hit this new button that is in everybody's window right now or in everybody's Cerebro window called Opportunity Keywords, and it's going to go ahead and give you that list right off the bat. So, for example, I click that one filter uh, or that one button on that uh, collagen gummy bear list. And all these keywords came up. Take a look at this one, hair pills. Now, the reason hair pills didn't come up in step 1A as one of the main top keywords is because look here at this competitor performance. It was only a two out of 10, right? And the reason is the rank average, in other words, all of those top competitors, if I just take their average rank of where they're showing up in Amazon search results, it's 177. That's like what, page three or four, right? So you might, someone might think, ah, oh, that's not an important keyword, but take a look here. If we dive into where those top competitors are ranking, here is why it came up in that one click filter. There is one of those products who is ranked number eight on page one. Everybody else is on page two, three, four, five, and six. So when somebody types in hair pills and maybe they're looking for collagen gummies, there's only one person who is dominating all of those sales, one person. So that means if you came in with a collagen gummy and you somehow got to page one, you're only competing with this one person as opposed to on those other keywords, you're having to compete with all the top sellers. All right, so this is so valuable, guys. Finding this, finding this at all is just amazing. Like Helium 10 has been the only tool who can even find this, but now, with just one click. You can do it now with one click. So this is awesome. All right. You guys excited so far? We got a question here, Carla, <laughs> from Carla, 
who do we tag on Instagram? Um, Carrie, what, what's the Instagram um, tag? At, at Helium 10 Software. Helium 10 Software, guys. Make sure to Our find Instagram. that and tag it. And Cassandra's going to hook you up with some swag. Uh, some of you guys who do that. Uh, Craig sure says, this follow. is kind of amazing. Yeah. What'd you say? Make sure to follow our Instagram too. If you yeah, are make sure to follow, follow our Instagram too. Yeah, yeah. We always have good stuff on here. Yeah. Denise says, wow, Craig, this is kind of amazing. Carla says, thank you. Or she's saying thank you to Carrie actually for hooking over the Instagram thing. <laughs> uh, Liwan says, love this new feature. I love it guys. We're just getting started here. All right. Another thing that we uh, launched a couple of weeks ago, this wasn't today. What I just showed you guys was just today. This is a couple of weeks ago. All right. But maybe you guys haven't seen it yet. All right. Take a look at this search results on Amazon. This is Amazon, not Helium 10, all right? Now, what two new things do you see on here that maybe more than two weeks ago you didn't see? Who can tell me? Who can tell me? Ah, Sheila's got it hey, there, the flag. Uh-huh, good, look at that. Chris says flag. Seller country, yeah, Gina, Gina's got it. There's one more thing though, guys. There is one more thing, it's kind of small. One more thing. Does any eagle eye member out there see it? No, not the variations. I ver Dude, is that new? That's not new, is it? We've had that for a while, right? Yeah, we've had variations. A Helium 10 employee got it. I want somebody out there. Sarah, come on. You should know. Of course, of course you should know, Sarah. Good job. Yes, yes. Wait, wait. somebody said it there. This is, the, the, the chat is going by so fast. I can't even like see who said it. Uh, Amir. Amir's got it and Abdul's got it. All right, Amir and Abdul, the x-ray button. Okay, so the first thing that everybody talked about was this flag. Now, um, you know, are, are, are we trying to get, get excited for World Cup or what do these flags uh, represent, uh, Carrie? Uh, those represent the seller countries for whoever is selling that product. That's the country that they're located in. Exactly. All right. Now, now, Carrie, how, how could people use this? I mean, there, there's a little, no like one way that this is beneficial, but what are what are the reasons why you think people are asking us to to do this? Well, um, first of all, say you had, a, you know, products and most of the sellers were from directly from China. They're going to be able to give a better pricing because they're the manufacturers and they're going to go direct to the customer. So there's that potential that they could offer a better price and maybe beat you out. However, it could also be an opportunity because maybe you can provide better customer service. You can write a better listing. You can do better photos. So there's opportunity there. Now on the other side, um, if it's, you know, a lot of, um, sellers that are located in the U.S., you might have a lot of competition because they, you know, really up their image game and um, they've done a lot of great copy. So, you know, there's there's a lot of different ways to look at it. So it'll be individual to whatever you're look, whatever the product is you're looking at. But it's definitely a helpful thing to, to take a look at. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. And the other thing that Abdul and Amir notice is right down here in the bottom right, a little button that says X-ray. So a lot of Chrome extensions out there, you know, just one Chrome extension, but you know, our, or one tool, I should say, but our Chrome extension, we have about eight different tools in it. And so we noticed, and everybody was asking like, Hey, I mainly use x-ray like nine times out of 10 x-ray is what I'm using. And it's kind of tedious in order to have to, to click the Chrome extension at the top of the screen, find x-ray, then click x-ray and then wait for it to show up. So we're like, you know what, for those of you who just want to use x-ray, like without having to do multiple clicks, We'll go ahead and put that right here. So you're on any search result page. This will show up at the bottom right. You don't have to hit the Chrome extension button anymore. Just hit this X-ray button and it'll pop right up on the screen. Now, speaking of X-ray, we've got a couple additions, like just like you guys saw the, the flag uh, there on the search result page. Well, now the seller country is also showing up in the X-ray results. So it gives you kind of more of a holistic uh, or a overall view of what's going on in the page instead of just seeing what's what's you know on the top you know the top ones there so like for example you can see here in the coffin shelf niche we've got most sellers from us but we've got one from great britain and also one from uh, china here in the top 20 results right here uh the other thing that we added in the chrome extension this here is a little screenshot hope you guys can see this a little screenshot from an actual product page and what do you guys see highlighted in yellow there that was not there a few weeks ago does anybody see that or maybe you guys noticed it whenever you're on product pages now and you have the Helium 10 Chrome extension installed. Yes, the 30 day sales. Again, people were telling us, hey, you know what? When I'm on a product page, I kind of want to know how much it's selling. And yeah, Helium 10 has always shown that. I can click on X-ray. I can look at the estimated sales, but I would just love to just see that right 
when I get on the page, all right? So we're like, hey, ask and we'll deliver, all right? So we have now, without having to click on x-ray, go to any Amazon product page. And if there's, you know, BSR history, um, you're going to now see the 30-day sales estimate. You can click on that and you'll see the history. You can go back 90 days. You can go back 180 days or all time now to see the sales, all right? So guys, th these are some cool, cool uh, additions, all right? Uh, Austin says that's a super awesome improvement. Now, oh, this is perfect. Harris, like this is not a Helium 10 employee here. Her uh, at least I don't think we, we have like 7 billion employees now. Harris Ibar, do you see what he asked there, uh, Carrie? I love it. It says any updates for Walmart. Okay, so before we get into that, that I mean, that's a great segue. Somebody pay, you yeah. know, Harris, your check Perfection. is in the mail. You, you're awesome. Your timing is impeccable. Um, let, let, I want to throw up another poll right here. Uh, Harris is asking about Walmart. I'm just curious. Uh, what, what are we trying to find out here, Carrie? Um, are you currently selling on walmart.com? So we're definitely curious to see who on the webinar is already selling and maybe, um, you know, what you're planning on doing. Are you planning on selling on Walmart? Do you want to, or you're not interested at all? So we'll see what well, we, we have a lot. Here. We got about um, a couple hundred people says I'm not selling, but I plan to. We've got a hundred says they're already selling on Walmart. Nice. All right. Excellent. Excellent. All right. So Carrie, let's start talking about Walmart. What's the first one that you've got for us? All right. So this is really, really exciting. We've made some improvements to keyword tracker. We did launch this a little while back. And um, first of all, it's great for Walmart strep ranking strategies. You know, it's kind of a lot of people are new in the game and you're trying to figure out ways to rank. So we've got our keyword tracker so you can add in your own keywords. But the best thing is we have the estimated search volume now in there. So you can prioritize what keywords you want to focus on with your with your rank strategy. So, you, you know, the higher the search volume, probably the more visibility you'll get. So definitely a good way to keep track of where you stand on sponsored and organic. Um, you can test out your pay-per-click to see if that's helping with your ranking and, you know, maybe any other strategies that you're utilizing. Maybe you're, um, you know, doing some other tactics to get ranking and conversions. So um, you can actually uh, track those here along with your pay-per-click. So it's very, very exciting. My favorite, especially don't forget, is we have this boost feature that you can track it every hour, especially when you're launching. I am always just glued to this whenever I'm launching a product, just every hour seeing where I'm going and what's happening. So that is an amazing feature. So we have all these amazing features for Walmart now and definitely a really helpful thing for any Walmart sellers, um, especially while we're, we're learning the ranking strategies and, and getting all of that dialed in. Awesome. Awesome. Now, one thing I wanted to, to share with you guys, uh, there was a hundreds of you who said you were helium 10 platinum or above. And so you're probably some of our over 30,000 recent freedom ticket 3.0 students, or right, we launched freedom ticket 3.0 just a few months ago, late last year. And we've already had over 30,000 students go through the course and 3.0 is, is better than 2.0 and 1.0 combined. We've got over 160 training modules in there. And that goes along with what Carrie is now going to uh, announce. Yes. And I'm very, very excited. We worked really hard on this. This is Freedom Ticket 3.0 Walmart. So I actually worked with Michael Labar and David Milstein from Cellcore. They are not only amazing multi-million dollar Walmart sellers, but they have an agency as well. So we went through and gave detailed extra detailed information on how to get started on Walmart, all the ins and outs of Seller Center, how to utilize our Helium 10 tools to boost your business. It has everything that you need to know in this um, in this freedom ticket. So definitely check it out. It's really, Super really real good. Quick though, you, yeah. you mentioned Michael Labar there. We got to yes. give a shout out to him. He's got a kind of a yes. funny look on his face. Well, that might be because he got engaged last last uh, uh, last week, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah. we got to give a special shout out. He's a friend of the family of Helium Ten family. Uh, yes. Of course, Freedom Ticket. He's been on the podcast many times. So Mazel Tov to uh, Michael. Yes. Um, I heard his fiance is a uh, like a world class uh, track athlete. She couldn't run yeah. away fast enough from Michael though. Uh, he caught up to her. So so Michael, congratulations <laughs> and. Uh, you see, you guys work with Helium 10. You never know what might blessings, uh, what blessings might come to your life there. But anyways, I, I digress. Let's get back to uh, talking about Freedom Ticket here. Yeah, so uh, here are some of the modules you can uh, check out. And so it's definitely something you definitely don't want to miss, especially if you're thinking of selling on Walmart or you're already selling. They have a lot of great little hidden gems that they, they talk about in these uh, episodes. So you definitely don't want to miss it. You'll learn how to do everything the right way and you'll learn some amazing tips and tricks along the way. 
Yes, absolutely. And and we've got it wasn't just oh, like, hey, let's add about, you know, five, five different modules here for free or for, for Walmart. You know, you can't learn Walmart in, in, in one hour or something. We have over 20 modules that carry uh, worked months and months on guys uh, that for both Project W and also for the freedom ticket only modules that she did with Michael and David. So guys, uh, you know, first of all, give her, give her a, a applause for all of her hard work on this because I don't know Walmart myself. So I was like, Hey, Carrie, you know, you, you got to help us out here because I can't, uh, Kevin King and myself don't really know Walmart as well as you do. So that's why Carrie led up this project. And so it's finally available. Everybody who's got platinum and above, remember you have full access to the entirety of Freedom Ticket, including the uh, new section here at the end, at the very end of uh, week, after week 10, you're gonna see it right there in your Freedom Ticket, guys. So start today, Freedom Ticket for Walmart. Now, people still might have some questions about Walmart. I see people in the in the chat right now throwing in questions. What do we have for them so that they can, you know, they can maybe get some community help? We have, and if you haven't joined this, I want you to go right now and join this community because you, We'll learn so much from this community. It's Helium 10 Winning with Winning with Walmart group. It's on our Facebook group. So all you have to do is you know type that title in and you can uh, ask to join. This is an amazing group of sellers in here. We've got Walmart sellers that are already selling, a lot of seasoned sellers, and then also people who are just now starting on Walmart asking questions. And it's really cool because the community is really jumping in there and answering and helping each other out. I also go live every Wednesday in that chat uh, or in that group to you know answer questions and go over any new features that we have we'll also be adding some more content to that uh, you know in the future just more detailed content so this is a group that's going to help support you along the way so um you know watch those freedom ticket modules and project w but also join this group just in case you have any other questions because you'll get them answered here um and you know yeah so Right now, if you have not joined this group, go join it. We have almost 2,000 members, and it's a great community, very, very helpful place if you're starting at Walmart. Yeah, don't forget, guys. You know, community is very important to us at, at Helium 10. Without you guys, we wouldn't we wouldn't uh, be here, and we want to support you in the best way that we can, and not just you know directly from Helium 10, but by community uh, being with other community, right? You know, like everybody interacting with each other, networking. So we've got this Facebook, we've got the Helium 10 members Facebook. We have two, our newest two Facebook groups is the Helium 10 in Deutsch in German, and also the Helium 10 in Espanol. We have two Facebook groups for Spanish and German. Um, and we also have the Amazon FBA High Rollers group that you can join. So you've got plenty of networking, plenty of community that uh, communities that you can join on Facebook. So just make sure to take advantage of these. Now I've got speaking of different languages, I've got some questions for you guys. Now, all right, here we go. Hablas español, parli italiano, sprechen Sie Deutsch, ni a jongmen ma. All right. Now if you guys understood. One of these questions, guess what? You'll be happy with the next announcement, all right? Helium 10 in your language, all right? So now, if you are in Helium 10 and you understood one of those four languages, which was uh, Spanish, German, Italian, and Chinese, what you have now, uh, you click on the top right of your um, profile on the Helium 10 dashboard, hit settings, and then on the top right of that page, we have now in beta, to change Helium 10 into the language of your mother tongue, if this is one of them. Again, German, Spanish, Italian, and Chinese. Not all the tools yet are fully translated, but a lot of our core tools are. For example, here's Cerebro if you have Chinese activated. Here is X-Ray, the Chrome extension, if you have Spanish activated. And here's Magnet, how it looks if you have German uh, activated. So uh, I wanna throw up a, a, a poll real quick that, uh, now. And which of these is your first language? You know, English or one of these four that we mentioned, Spanish, Italian, German, and Chinese. And there should have been an other one here, but there's no other. So if it's not, if, if you are not one of these languages, put in the chat really quick, what is your first language? If it's not one of these, one, two, three, four, five, five languages here. Put in the chat and Carrie, you know, what, what are some languages that you see? Uh, Korean, okay. Swedish, Russian, Vietnamese, Danish, Cambodian, uh, wow. Turkish, French. Uh, Spanish. Spanish um, is here. Hebrew, oh, we got Hebrew, Spanish up here. Estonian. Um, Urdu, Urdu. Filipino, Hungarian, Arabic, Nepali. You got a Hindi. lot of other languages here. I love it. Yeah. All right. 
Looks like there was a lot of Spanish speakers uh, from this poll. We got German, a lot of uh, German speaking. Don't forget Spanish and German. We, we have a lot of support now. Uh, also, all of our learn button videos and the entirety of Freedom Ticket is either already translated or in process of being translated for these subtitles. So keep that in mind too. Wherever you see a learn button uh, with a training video inside of Helium 10, you hit the CC button on the bottom and you can choose Chinese, German, um, Italian, Spanish in order to, to get those with subtitles, uh, Freedom Ticket and the learn button videos. All right, so at this uh, time, Carrie, I think you, you have a, you invited a, so somebody to crash our party here. So why don't you go ahead and yes. introduce this gentleman? Yes. So we have Adam Shabazz, who is our VP of strategy, and he is going to come on and talk about our new seller solutions hub, which is known as our trusted partner directory. We've actually done a rebrand and a facelift for it and a lot of new amazing features. And he's going to go ahead and talk about it. So welcome, Adam. Hey, guys. Hey, Carrie. Hey, Bradley. Uh, thanks for having me on. I was, I was sitting here so eagerly awaiting this moment. Uh, we've been working for about a year on this since we announced Trusted Partner Directory, and the day is finally here. Uh, it's super exciting, uh, but we're here to announce Seller Solutions Hub, which is essentially one-stop shop uh, resource for sellers to come and find service providers in the, uh, in the Amazon FBA and e-commerce space. Um, so how is this different or better than anything else that you might be looking for? So one of the, one of the key things we're really trying to solve with this is trying to solve the problem of, you know, when you're trying to make a choice for finding a, a provider in the industry, um, you know, how do you find the right one? Who do you listen to? How do you make sure that you're not making the, the wrong choice? So it could be very expensive um, and it can be very confusing and, and can be very frustrating. So what we've done is we've tried to organize uh, all of the partners of the ecosystem that we could find. We talked to every single one of them and we bring, uh, we bring them on the platform and then we actually expose them to the community to get reviews. And today we've actually launched uh, a new feature, which you can kind of see on the right side here, is called the Verified Seller Review. So if you see that little tag on the reviews for our partners, you know that that's actually coming from a seller that was verified as an actual Amazon seller who's using Helium 10, who you know more or less knows what they're talking about and has worked with this partner, and you know, and you can you can trust that review. So we're really hoping to provide a uh, you know a trusted resource where the community can come uh, and find great partners. And so we have partners here. We actually have. Uh, hundreds of partners currently on. Uh, we're adding new partners all the time. Uh, you can see um, in the screenshot here, we have Marketing by Emma. We do a lot of content with them. If you go to their listing, you can sort of see all the content we've done. You can see all the reviews with them. Um, they're doing listing optimization. We have uh, freight forwarding, uh, PPC agencies, just really across the board, anything you could really need outside of what Helium 10 provides you, uh, you can get from Seller Solutions Hub. Let me go to the, uh, how can people find, uh, Adam, this cool. new uh, hub? Sure. Yeah. So just go to hub.helium10.com. Um, and as you saw in the last slide, we're actually asking our partners to bring forward any discounts they might have to, um, you know, help incentivize anything that we're currently working on. So as you know, it's our, it's our sixth birthday uh, this week. So we have a bunch of partners there um, providing special deals uh, that are they're just good until the, the 23rd of this month. So go today, check it out, take advantage of the deals. And every time we have, uh, you know, sort of a new offer out in the market, um, you know, we bring partners on and allow them to, you know, potentially help support that. So check it out, hub.helium10.com. Um, check it out today and, and go get yourself a great deal. Awesome. And then Chelsea, if you guys see there, Chelsea put that link there in case you didn't get that right there in the chat. So uh, hub.helium10.com, you can bookmark it and use that as your one-stop shop when trying to you know, look for service providers and also help with your Amazon or Walmart business. Kara, are you back with us yet? Sheila has a question there. How can we get into the hub as a service provider, Adam? Sure, so if you actually go um, to Seller Solutions Hub and scroll all the way to the bottom, um, you can, you'll see a link there that says apply to be a partner and that'll take you through our process. Our partnerships team will reach out to you. Um, and we have a little bit of a vetting process that we go through to make sure we have sort of top partners on the hub. Um, so go ahead and check that out. And if you're, a, if you're actually a user of, of the uh, Seller Solutions Hub and you have feedback for us, we're very, very open to that. So feel free to shoot us an email at partners at helium10.com. And we'd love to hear your ideas, your thoughts, ways that we can make it better. Uh, we really want this to be a great resource uh, for, for the community. All right. Uh you were muted there for a second, Kerry. So if you were trying to test it, it wouldn't have, we wouldn't have heard it. But anyways, let's let's switch gears now and talk about something else. The Sell and Scale Summit. Now, before 
we get into this with, with Adam here. I'm going to, I just want to throw something out there. All right. Every single person, every single pitcher on, uh, or every single person here on this page has been, except for one, has been on the Serious Sellers podcast. Now, if there is somebody out there who can say the names of every person on here, I'm going to personally send you guys a Helium 10 microphone and a Helium 10 backpack because this is going to be hard. A lot of, you know, there's one person you should definitely, or there's two people on here you should definitely know who they are, probably three. But everybody has been on the podcast here. So I'm just curious if one person, the first person to get every single name right here is going uh, is going to get like a special gift directly from me. Now, who are these people? Why do we have a picture of these people, Adam, on, on this page? Uh, yeah, so the, the, what you're looking at actually is just a, a small selection of the top shelf speakers that we're going to be ha- hosting at Sell and Scale Summit in Las Vegas this September at the Virgin Hotel. We are actually taking over the whole hotel. Um, it's going to be it's going to be probably the most amazing. It's going to be the most amazing conference for the Amazon FBA and e-commerce seller community um, that I've ever been to, and hopefully that you've ever been to. Uh, we've got amazing things planned, and as you can see from this selection of speakers, we have really, really great, um, great content planned. And headlining the whole event is none uh, none other than Gary V. Um, so I'm really excited for this event. We've got um, if I can just go through a few highlights. Please, um, please. Yeah. So, and meanwhile, to- Carrie, if you can just keep yourself unmuted, so then we we'll let you know when when we start uh, hearing you. There we go. Okay. Oh, no, awesome. we heard you. Oh, Perfect. Here. You're good to go. <laughs> yes. Please, please continue, Adam. Please continue. All right. All right. Cool. <laughs> so, just so you guys know, so what we what we've tried to do with Sell and Scale Summit is we wanted to create a situation where no matter where you are in your e-commerce journey, there's something for you there to help you get to the next level. So we have, in addition to these top shelf keynotes, we've got three tracks that you can join. Fortify, uh, make sure I say it right. Fortify foundations for success, strengthen your brand and smash sales goals, and scale, dom- dominate, and exit. So, depending on where you are in your seller journey, we have content that's targeted towards you. And then, in addition to those breakout sessions that are going to be hosted by folks like Trevin and Lazar and Destiny here, um, and Kevin King doing really high level content, we're going to have you know PPC masterminds. We're going to have networking events. We're going to have all sorts of amazing, just unparalleled experiences that are all designed again to t- take your business to the next level. Yes, absolutely. Now. Um, you know, we, we don't have the list of all the topics here, but maybe could you give us one or two of the, the topics or features that we can, we can expect? I mean, Gary V, like he can talk about air and I think we would be kind of excited to, uh, <laughs> to listen to that. But do you have any of the finalized topics that you can, that you can share? Yeah. So, so first of all, we actually have all of the topics posted. Uh, the full agenda is posted online at sell oh, and scale summit.com. Yep. You can check that out. Um, and And so to give you an example of some of the topics we're talking about, um, so I already talked about, we're going to have a a PPC panel. Um, So we saw Melissa and Destiny um, on that last slide there, you know, Melissa Burdick is the president of PacView, Destiny Wishes, the CEO of Better AMS. So we have, you know, really high level uh, speakers coming. They're going to do a panel focused on, you know, how to improve your PPC game. We're going to have, we're going to have. Uh, Kevin King doing sort of product research, and we're going to have Tomer Rabinovich doing, you know, sort of how to run your business better. We're going to have also sort of new stuff like how to, you know, do off Amazon traffic generation. We're going to be having sessions on Walmart. Um, The whole agenda is listed. So I really recommend everybody go check it out right now. Um, Go get your ticket. Uh, They're selling really fast. Another couple of really exciting things that we're doing that I think I've never seen anywhere. We're doing Ask Me Any- Anythings with the uh, with sort of industry stars. And so they're going to ha- have sort of breakout sessions where you can come in and just, just sort of ask them anything, you know, surround them with a bunch of e-commerce sellers and, you know, and pick their brains. And it's going to be, it's going to be really, really amazing. Uh, the Virgin Hotel is gorgeous. It's right off the strip. It's sort of its own enclosed environment. Um, it's going to be great food, great entertainment. Oh, I didn't even talk about that. And our Tuesday night party. Anybody want to take a guess? It's from my yes. one of my favorites from my high school days. <laughs> I have a lot of lights on in my office. I could say it's it, it's getting hot in here. It's, <laughs> it's, please please keep your clothes on. Okay, okay. it's gonna be it's gonna is be. That, is that enough of a hint? Uh, <laughs> I don't think that's a lyric. Uh, it is Nelly. So yeah. Nell, the famous rapper Nelly is going to be uh, putting on a show for Tuesday night. 
Um, and then Wednesday night is going to be all the great industry parties from all of our various partners. We've got um, about 100 different partners in the ecosystem that are going to be there. Uh, we've got Walmart taking the uh, elite sponsorship. So there's going to be lots of lots of great stuff going on. You do not want to miss this. It's going to be Zumba Fitness be. in the morning to oh, wake you up. It's Vegas. Well, we, we got fitness. everything that you've never seen in an Amazon conference. Uh, <laughs> I could talk about this for hours. Before. It's going to be absolutely incredible. Go to sellandscalesummit.com right now. Uh, last question for you, Adam, here. Um, I saw a couple of people asking about this. Uh, the VIP uh, section, like, like, what are the benefits of uh, a couple of them? I know we don't have time to talk about all of them, but uh, there's a VIP option uh, on the website. And what does that exactly mean? Yeah, so there's going to be some, um, just some sort of, separate things that you're going to get that are going to be a little bit better. So a little bit higher level, you know, food, and you're going to have a special lounge and there's going to be special seating in the theater. Um, so the way the Virgin Hotel is set up, it has this amazing theater. It's actually more designed for rock shows, but we're sort of uh, going to turn it into a conference hall. Um, and so they're going to have sort of a private, private dinner and private events. And then there's also going to be sort of additional content that's geared specifically for that crowd. So they're going to have special guests that other people don't get. They're going to be, you know, there's, there's sort of a lot that goes into it. So again, you know, check out the site for details. Um, we're going to be announcing more speakers coming up, uh, more keynotes coming up. So it's just going to get more and more exciting. All right. Well, Adam, thank you so much for joining us today. We are super excited. And thanks for your hard work in, in bringing this and also our hub uh, to life. Appreciate it. Thanks so much, guys. Um, real quick here. I saw tons of people almost get it right for, for who those speakers were. They only miss it by one. So the first person that I saw that got it all right and uh, is Duncan Kenning. So Duncan Kenning, please reach out to customer service and say that you won the prize today and they'll connect you with uh, my team so that we can get your address and get that out to you. But, but Duncan Kenning got it right. Gary V, Kevin King, Melissa Burdick, Trevin Peterson, Lazar, uh, and he didn't try and spell Lazar's last name because nobody can, uh, Destiny Wishon and Melanie from AVASK. So he was the first one to get it right. Good job, uh, Duncan. Um, Carrie, uh, another swag opportunity here. Yeah, so um, go ahead. We actually have an Instagram for the Sell and Scale Summit on Instagram. It's at Sale and Scale Summit on Instagram. So go ahead, if you're on your phones right now, Go ahead and search that and follow it and then take a picture of yourself while watching this webinar post it to your instagram story and then tag uh, sell and scale summit on there and you can win some more swag so you have another opportunity to win some cool helium 10 swag um, and then you'll also be up to date on anything new that we announced for that conference and you'll just be all in the know so definitely follow us on instagram there as well all right let's get back to the tools now uh carrie you're about to actually introduce not a new feature but an entirely new tool a uh, mini tool here in Helium 10. Yes. Um, so this is actually really helpful. A lot of sellers, when they start selling, they're not necessarily envisioning selling on Amazon forever. They have a, a vision of eventually exiting their brand, you know, scaling it up and then selling it. So we wanted to give you a kind of an estimated tool to help you to get a ballpark idea of what your company might be worth or your, your Amazon business might be worth. So you, the way to get this is actually gonna be on your dashboard. So you can see a screenshot here up at the top right, it says estimated brand values. So we have a, some calculations that we put together to give you kind of a, a guesstimate of what your brand could be worth. Um, this is not gonna be obviously an exact number, but it's gonna give you a ballpark number, give you a good idea, um, You know, make sure that you're, you know, hitting your goals and on track to do what you want to do. So the way that you need to do this is you actually have to have your Helium 10, Helium 10 account, account connected to Amazon. So we would pull in, it has to have 12 months of data. So you have to have 12 months of sales on Amazon in order to do this. And this is available for all of the paid plans. So if you are a paid Helium 10 subscriber, you get access to this. It'll show up on your dashboard. Um, and it's just a great way to, you know, keep that goal in mind, especially if your goal is to sell, it'll keep you motivated. Um, you take a look at that number and just keep pushing forward for your ultimate goal of exiting and selling for, for lots of money. Yep. So guys, if you, uh, if you don't see it, th there's a couple reasons. So, uh, you should, ha you, you have to have your, your token or uh, your Amazon account connected to helium 10, first of all, and there should be at least 12 months of sales history for that account. So if you just started selling six months ago, you're not going to see an, uh, an estimate there, but any, as long as you have a platinum or above account. It, your Amazon Seller Central account is connected to Helium 10 uh, and you have at least 12 months of sales history, you will now see this on the top right of your screen. 
All right, let's go ahead and get into some of our, uh, some more exciting, exciting updates on an existing tool. All right, how many people here, uh, let me know in the chat, how many people here use Listing Analyzer? And by the way, Rami already uh, pulled up his account and, and his is showing uh, $1.5 million for his account. Ooh, everybody now wants to become friends with Rami. Drinks uh, at Sell and Scale Summit, drinks are on uh, Rami because he, he's the big baller here. <laughs> all right. So Karen Deep uses Listing Analyzer. Chris uses it all the time. Tanner does. I love it. Tons of people. All right. So you guys are very familiar with this screen. All right. What you do in Listing Analyzer, you enter in a, a series of ASINs and you get some kind of like top level information. So as it is right now, and then this is how it's still going to be for platinum members, you're still going to see this, but I'm going to show you guys, those of you who are diamond and elite, what kind of new fun things you're going to have, but you, you get like an overview with our listing analyzer score and you get the ASIN and then you get the title and the image now, but now if you have a diamond account as of today, take a look at what you're going to see. Same, you enter the same ASINs. Look at this. You're going to see the listing quality score, but now you're going to see the seller country. Now, uh, there's no country on this because this is just a, a Amazon product, but you'll see USA, USA, USA here. You'll see the ratings. You'll see the review count. You're going to see how old the listings are all on a chart right here. You'll see the price. You'll see the estimated monthly sales and revenue. The, the fulfillment. Is it FBA? Is it uh, fulfilled by or shipped and sold by Amazon? Is it uh, fulfilled by merchant? You're going to see how many keywords they have in the top 10 of the search results organically. And of those top 10 keywords, what is their search volume? Like for example, this product here, Smarty Pants, no wonder why it's doing $2.5 million a month. They are on page one positions one through 10 of 6,000 keywords that total 2 million searches per month, all right? So you got all of this cool information here as soon as you enter this, those of you who have Diamond and Elite. Now, the bottom part of Listing Analyzer, and this is actually gonna be for everybody, including Platinum members are gonna see this new update. This is what you guys have seen now, right? And which is, again, this is has always been and is very valuable, right? You are gonna see here, you know, the, the top keywords in a certain niche if you're entering in multiple ASINs. And what basically we were doing is kind of like running a mini Cerebro search in the background here, right? So you'll see some of those top keywords, you'll see the search volume. And then if you put your mouse over um, the organic rank, you'll see where those individual ASINs are showing up. This, this has always been the case, you know, since day one of Listing Analyzer, you've been able to see this, but then we got some feedback and they're like, Hey, we want to kind of like, instead of having to put my mouse over every single one, it'd be so much to just visually look at it in a little bit better way. So now as of today, every member platinum diamond elite, you now have this additional visibility for this. It's still going to show you those top keywords, those top 10 keywords. You'll still see the same information, but instead of having to mouse over one by one, you're going to see it all in this chart. You're going to see the organic rank average, the performance score average, and then one by one for these top keywords, you are going to see where the organic rank is for each of them. So for example, you can see on, uh, this just makes a lot of sense here. Here's one of the top keywords is a branded term for Ollie or Ole, Ole. I don't know, I don't know how to say that, Ollie, I guess. Um, and you'll see, wow, they're, they're ranked number one for these top seven keywords right here. And here they're they're uh, 14 point, uh, 14, ranked 14. Here they're 8.5, uh, their average rank that it's been. So you guys, you guys get to see this cool information here all on a graphical, uh, interface so that you don't have to put your mouse over. You guys like that so far? Let me, let, I'm not caught up here in the chat. What are people saying here? Uh, Jake says, how do I get my boss to quit bothering me during your webinar? Well, you tell him that the Kansas City Chiefs suck, um, Jake, because I know Jake's boss is a Kansas City Chiefs fan. Linda says, cool, all one page, diamond member only. So this is for everybody, Linda. So if you have platinum, you are going to see this now. All right, let's keep going. Listing analyzer or who said this is epic or this is perfect? Uh, Delaney says, yeah, this heck yeah, this is perfect. All right, awesome, all right? More, more, more is coming, all right? So I'm gonna give you guys a blast to the uh, to the pass here. This here, uh, there, there's some of you who said you've been Amazon sellers for quite a while. Maybe you've been healing 10 members for a while. This is a screenshot from a webinar I did in 2019, all right? 20, beginning of 2019 on listing optimization. 
right? This is an old school screenshot when we still used to use PowerPoint. Now we use Google Slides for everything. But what we were talking about in this webinar is what uh, we called niche themes. And we talked about analyzing the images. Now, I wasn't the one who created this idea. The Where I started teaching this from was actually from uh, somebody that Adam says is one of our speakers at Sell and Scale Summit. And that's Tomer Rabinovich. And, and he taught me this way where he's like, hey, what I do whenever I launch a new product, is I'll go get those top 10 competitors. And of course, you know, I'll go ahead and analyze their keywords and things like that in Cerebro. But I also go and copy all of their images and I put it into like a PowerPoint or I put it into a Google doc and lay them all out, all, you know, one through seven, if they have it, one through eight, whatever their images are. And then I try and look for a niche theme. In other words, like for example, I use this as an example. If you see here, this these cell phone cases, they all had a front and back view. That was like the niche theme. Like everybody seemed who is in the top players in this niche were like, hey, we got to put a front and back view. So you should probably do the same thing with yours. And then what you also will find is these kind of patterns with the secondary and tertiary, uh, tertiary, why am I like saying ridiculous words? The secondary and other uh, words, secondary and other <laughs> pictures here, right? Like I notice here that the second or third image in this cell phone niche um, they all had like a picture of a cell phone case dropping and uh, kind of like a call out to how the cell phone case protects your phone when it drops. So guess what? If all of your top players are doing that, they probably, you know, have done the research that this is important. So you should probably do something similar. So what Tomer does is he prints out the kind of theme on, uh, on the images that the sellers all have. And then he gives that to his like graphic designers and gives it to his photographers and say, hey, try and follow this theme, see what's working here, but just obviously make it different, a little bit different and better. And so since 2019, we have been talking about that. And we just had a listing optimization webinar two months ago that Leilama and I did. And we talked about this very strategy. You guys can check that out at h10listings.com. That's a two hour workshop that we did all in listing optimization. So we've been teaching this strategy, but it's kind of tedious, It's kind of tedious to do, you know, let me open up seven windows and let me just copy one by one, these, these images, and let me put it in a Google doc or something like that. So here is what we now have in listing analyzer. You hit this button now, and this, this is for diamond and above for now, this is diamond and elite members have this and you call it media comparison. So you already entered in all of these ASINs so you can see where, where, how, how they stack up as far as a listing quality score, how they stack up as far as the top keywords go. But now without having, ha having to even visit their listings or copy and paste images or anything, you see it all laid out here. Just like Tomer has always taught, lay the pictures out. And what do we see here? This, this was those gummy bears I was telling you about. You notice stuff right off the bat. First of all, everybody's using like a 3D image of their main one. You can see that just very clearly here. You see that everybody has an image of the supplement facts, probably a requirement on Amazon, but every single competitor has that. Another thing that I noticed here that I might have missed if I was just looking at these images one by one is look, every single one here, they have a picture with somebody holding the, the, the gummy like in their hand to kind of show the size. They, they, this person did that, this one did it here and, and here. So I'm like, I might have even not have thought about that, but obviously that's probably they did that because they probably saw a lot of questions or reviews or people like, Hey, how big are these gummies or, or, you know, like, is it easy to digest or whatever the case is, they all did that research and came up with that. And now you could come in as a new seller and be like, no, I don't need to do a whole bunch of research. I just look at their images. And obviously this must be important to the uh, customers. I see everybody here is using like a lot of big words for their infographics and things. So like, maybe I'll, I'm going to want to do that. So again, guys, this was just one click after you enter in listing analyzer. So diamond and above guys, uh, get excited because this is super, super helpful. I mean, this is not new strategy. Like I said, we've been teaching this since 2018, but now you don't have to do so much hard work in order to get this layout. Rodrigo says, oof, wow. All right. Um, Ro Roberto says, these are amazing Tips. Love it. Love it. Uh, Zachary says, can this be exported to show a graphic designer? That is an excellent question. We are at, that's not ready yet in version one, but really soon we're going to have a button where you can put this into a PDF and then give that to your photographer or graphic designer. Excellent uh, question. Jamie says, I'm going to have to upgrade. Good job, Jamie. Uh, ADA Corp says, 
I wish media comparison would be available for platinum soon uh, too. That I can't, I can't speak on. This is brand new and like always usually brand new tools. Sometimes they only stay for Diamond and Elite, uh, but at least in the beginning, they always uh, stay for Diamond and Elite. All right, so that's enough uh, for, for me for right now. Let's go back to Carrie with some more updates here. Yeah, so we have some exciting updates for our academy and uh, the academy, if you haven't ever done this, this gives you in depth knowledge of all of our tools like what we're going over today. If you were to take this academy, you'll know every single tool in Helium 10 inside and out and ways that you can utilize them to boost your business, boost your sales and all the great things. So we've updated this academy, so it's completely up to date. We have all the, the latest and greatest in there. Um, you can see the core curriculum right here. We've got um, you know, our product research section, we have a lot of different sections in there and you can go and take this for free actually. And another thing is if you actually wanted to get certified, you actually can get certified as a helium tent expert if you um, pass our certification at the very end. So it's really helpful for freelancers and agencies to get certified in helium tent tools. It gives you a lot of credibility. Um, it's definitely a detailed uh, academy course that we have here. So you will be an expert in all things helium 10. And again, this is open to anyone. And it's really helpful for anyone to know these tools because you'll be able to go in and utilize them and even come up with your own strategies after you're you're an expert with the tools. Yep. So, so and this is completely free again, guys. Uh, Academy.helium10.com. Go bookmark that right now. Yeah, you have to sign up for a separate account because it's outside of Helium 10. But you don't even have to be a Helium 10 member to take advantage of it. So go to academy.helium10.com, completely free structured course so that you can learn the Helium 10 tools and, and the evangelism team. I, I didn't work any at all on this, this other project. This is kind of like when I was out of commission for uh, a while, but the entire evangel uh, evangelist team here worked night and day on re-recording the videos, making new certification and quiz questions and introduction videos. There's about, there's over a hundred videos in this course and it's a hundred percent free. Now what Carrie was mentioning about that certification is that one you have to pay for just like if you want to get Microsoft certified or something, you have to, you have to pay for that, but it's cool because it'll show up on your LinkedIn profile. Um, it's, it's great. If, if you have a, a full staff of employees, um, you can, you know, get them certified, uh, we have something cool coming up next month for the agencies for certification. But in the meantime, if you're a virtual assistant or you're a consultant, it's kind of great to show that you're Helium 10 certified because a lot of companies trying to hire somebody for their Amazon business, they are looking for people who know Helium um, 10. Um, so academy.helium10.com. All right, guys, you just type type that into the, the browser and that should work out. I'm not, sometimes if you put that HTTPS, it might not work, but academy.helium10.com. Uh, should work out. All right, let's go to the next uh, feature here. We got a pop quiz. So when doing PPC, guys, when doing PPC, how do you know if your bid is enough to put you at the top of the sponsor results? Like, how can you double check that? What are some ways? Let us know in the chat, guys. What are the ways, like, especially if you use Helium 10, like what would you do regardless if you use Atomic or not? Just how do you know? Like, cause you know, Amazon gives a suggested bid, but usually that's not enough to get you to the, to the top. All right. I don't see yes. anyone yet who said it. There we go. Tony says Cerebro. You can do it on oh, Cerebro. Okay. Yeah. 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 Very true. All right. Sponsored rank. Gina says Gina's a elite helium 10 elite. Yes. Member, so I would expect her to know that. And how do you know what your sponsored rank is? Well, you do that in keyword tracker, right? So I, me personally, what I do is I, I open up, I, I use atomic to, to run my PPC and I'll check my bid there and maybe atomic suggests like a certain bid change. But before I actually accept that bid change, I'll go to my keyword tracker. I'll find, I'll see if I'm tracking that keyword. And then I look at where I'm showing up for in that sponsored rank, because if I'm bidding $1 and I'm like, hmm, do I want to raise this or not? But I look at Keyword Tracker and it says, hey, I'm position page one, position one for a sponsor. Well, I mean, you know, I'm not going to raise, I don't need to raise my, my bid because I'm already page one, position one, right? All right. So Carrie, what do you have to share with us now? Yes. So this is amazing news because instead of having to go back and forth from Adtomic to Keyword Tracker, we have implemented Keyword Tracker into the Adtomic dashboard. So you don't have to go back and forth. I love this because I'm one of those people who loves everything all right in front of you so you can see. So you can see your search volume of the keywords. You can see the organic rank and the sponsored rank. So this is going to help you with a lot of different things with your launch strategies. Um, you can see how you're progressing in your organic rank. You can also see those sponsored rank, like Bradley was saying, to you know 
do you need to raise your bids? You know, you can check here to see, you know, if you're already at the top and winning those bids, you don't have to raise your, your bid any higher. So this is a, an excellent addition. I think this is going to be a game changer for a lot of people in their pay-per-click. It's going to save you so much time. You don't have to go back and forth. So it's definitely going to help a lot of people. Um, you can also expand that out and you can see your rank over time. Um, so all the kind of same great benefits that you have in the, the keyword tracker, you're, you're going to be able to see those in Adtomic in the, in the dashboard. So yeah. yeah. Uh, Linda says, Chris Tucker showed me that we have somebody who at our company named Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker. Like there's no rush hour four. So I guess he decided yeah, to Yeah, that's <laughs> Maybe, yeah. <laughs> All right, now, now Atomic is new for a lot of people and it's actually, you know, very, you know, PPC in general is very complex and then learning a new tool. So what have we, uh, what has our team here, I, which I guess includes Chris Tucker and, and Jackie Chan, but what have they made in order to help people uh, understand how to use uh, Atomic at no cost to anybody? There is an incredible boot camp coming up. So this is our Ad Atomic boot camp. It's going to be eight weeks of training. So definitely, this is something for anyone who wants to learn Ad Atomic from the inside out. You're going to get in-depth instruction here. So it's an eight-week eight-week Ad Atomic kind of boot camp training course. It starts June 28th at 8 a.m. Pacific time. Okay. So if you look at the very bottom, it says pages.helium10.com/slash/atomic dash all of that oh, that whole link there. <laughs> That's what you need to type in, and that's where you're going to find the page on Helium 10 for this Adtomic, you know, blast off boot camp. So I, I recommend this for really anyone who wants to learn the insides in inside and out Adtomic, all the different tips and tricks. Um, you're going to learn so much in this, and you're going to be able to optimize your PPC even better. So it'll save you money in the long term because you're going to know all the greatest latest strategies to do that. Um, so definitely, if you're interested in improving your PPC game go ahead and sign up for that boot camp. So um, yeah, we'll go ahead and find all the information on that link. Okay. All right, guys. So, so make sure to sign up. And if you miss that, you know, you can ask customer service or if it doesn't work, that link doesn't work for you, ask customer service and, and they'll be able to send that uh, link to you. Now, um, I see there's some questions here about, I kind of want to go through these last few slides, but if you have a question about not, not just in general, how do I sell on Amazon or something, but something about one of the tools that we launched today, save it to the end. We'll, we'll, we'll try and give you guys at least five minutes uh, to be able to get to some of these questions, but we got another one of these uh, pop quizzes. All right. You want to look at your page sessions or your conversion rate, your unit session percentage. How do you do this? How do you do this? How do you find that? Vincent says business reports. Yep. Seller, seller central. Yep. Gina says business reports. All right. So how many of you guys look at that frequently and, and how frequently do you look at that? You know, that's very important. If you guys look at our, um, um, our operations and analytics, a workshop. And that's that podcast that I told you guys to listen to after this. I talk about how important this report is. All right. Uh, Vincent says weekly. Joshua says all the time. Um, Linda says, I just looked at it yesterday and I need to refresh to learn. Well, guess what guys? Business reports are now inside of Helium 10. The information that is there. This is something that people have been asking us for years and we couldn't do it even if we wanted to, just because Amazon did not make that data point available to tools uh, like Helium 10, but recently they opened it up when they said that they wouldn't for years. And now they're, Amazon is really amazing guys. Like lately, Amazon has opened up so many things to sellers, to, to software companies that was not available before. So hats off to Amazon for, for making more data available. But guys, go into your profits now, go into your profits and look at the product performance page. All right, this is for platinum and above product performance page, you'll still see the stuff you've always seen before, you know, your gross revenue and your margins and things like that. But now at the end, you're going to see four, three new columns, your page views, your sessions and your unit session percentage. You know, here I got, you know, this um, egg tray, it's 12%. It's pretty decent, you know, for, 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 for this kind of product. But hmm, this uh, pink coffin shelf is only 4% unit session percentage. Well, that might make me need to go look into why is the uh, the conversion rate so bad on this. I, I got to go check this out. So guys, this is available as of today uh, for a, on your product performance page. Now, if you are a Diamond uh, and an Elite member, you guys have a little something, something extra um, here. Right here on the dashboard, you guys have had access to this, this special comparison chart. Everybody has a profit summary 
on their dashboard. But if you're a diamond and elite for a while, you guys have had access to this widget that allows you to compare different things. And now you can compare your business report metric with things like your sales. For example, as you guys are looking on here, this is the helium 10 coffin shelf sales for this month. And I was like, you know what? I want to compare it to the page sessions day by day of this product. You know, theoretically, if my page sessions are going up, you know, are my sales going up? Uh, if my page sessions go, or if my sales were down, was it because I didn't get many views on my listing that day? The possibilities are endless here, guys, with the kind of things that you can compare. So this is just the beginning. We just imported this into your, your dashboards, into your Seller Central or your Helium 10 accounts this week. And this is just a starting point. So as you guys start digging into, the, into this, we want to hear from you. How do you want to view this? Like maybe you want to see it in keyword tracker as a, as a graphing keyword tracker, or maybe you want to see it in a, in market tracker, right? Or maybe you want to see it in another one of our tools. Maybe you want to be able to compare it to something that we are not having right now. Well, let us know guys for, for any of this stuff. Remember all of these tools, all of these features that we announced today, every single one has been coming from your input. So how do you guys give us your input? Don't forget at the very top of any Helium 10 screen, there is like a little question mark button. So hit that and then hit the submit your ideas or submit your feature request, something like that. It'll say right there at the top and make sure to let your voices be heard. Not just about this, about how you want to see the business reports in the future, but about any of our tools. We can't guarantee that every single request is something that that we're going to implement. What, but what we do is we prioritize the ones that the most people are asking for. So the only way that you can get your voices heard is by going ahead and clicking that. And our product team, which is awesome here at Helium 10, Every week they have these meetings where they analyze everything that you guys are requesting and seeing what is the most requested, what is available, like what, what is possible to do, what's not possible to do. So I guarantee you guys, your voices are heard. And this webinar that we just went over should be proof of that because we are literally launching everything that you guys have been asking for. So guys, uh, I want to throw up something. We, we've talked about a lot of, of um, a lot of tool features here. I want to see what are you most excited about? So, so Gio, if you could throw up that last poll right here, which one are you most excited about? I'm excited about every single one of these, but, but I know you can't select multiple ones here. I just, if you had to pick one that you're like, Hey, I'm going to start using this right now to help me in my Amazon or Walmart business, which one would it be? All right. Oh yeah. Cerebro one click filters. Uh, listing analyzer updates, the key, uh, Atomic keyword tracker. Remember, guys, Atomic, you can see the analytics of Atomic if you're a platinum and, and above. But for the full Atomic, that is a diamond or elite uh, experience there. So it's a great time to, to, to give it a try. And I'm going to give you guys a little uh, special never offered before bonus uh, kind of like discount if you guys want to try out diamond or platinum for a time. But it looks like Cerebro one-click filters won. I love it. I love it. That That's one of my favorites yeah. too. Saves time. <laughs> Do you have picked that one? Which one would you have picked, uh, Carrie? Um, it's probably close. I think the Cerebro one click that, that I spend a lot of time sorting yeah. through stuff. And I think that's going to save a lot of time for people. So that's definitely. Yep. yep absolutely. Absolutely. All right. Now back to uh, Carrie for another one last announcement here. All right, so Helium 10 is actually celebrating uh, our birthday basically this this month actually in particular. Um, so we wanted to kind of give you a little, uh, you know, walk down to Nostalgia Lane. I'm actually curious to know if anyone has actually been with Helium 10 since the very beginning, May of 2016. Um, if any of you have been, I'd love to, you know, see in the chat if you have been, because that would be really interesting to see. Um, but um, we actually, you know, started off in May of 2016 with Manny announcing the Scribbles free edition of, you know, basically being able to build your listing. So if you want to go to the next slide, you can, you can see a little screenshot of the podcast. Um, and this is actually uh, on there. You can see it's May 10th of 2016, where Manny Coates went live and he talked about scribbles. And uh, so it's pretty cool to look back in time and see how it all began. And then uh, Helium 10 actually got our, our first paid sign up in, um, in May of 2016. So that's where it all started. 
2017, we saw Freedom Ticket launch, and I know a lot of you have taken Freedom Ticket back then. It was really exclusive, only available to the Illuminati, or that's what Elite used to be called, was the Illuminati, and it was this like exclusive group of sellers with all the best tips and tricks. Um, and so, and that's when we actually launched the Chrome extension and then Refund Genie as well. 2018 was when Black Box came into the picture, which is literally the best product research tool on the market. Um, with um, X-Ray and Profits, all of that, great, those great tools in 2018. 2019, we, with Bradley, launched the Serious Sellers podcast, literally the best podcast out there for Amazon sellers with all those strategies that he provides. It's literally the best. If you have not subscribed, definitely go check that out. It's been around since 2019. We're on almost, uh, we're almost to 350 episodes, right, Bradley? It's pretty, yep, pretty episode high up there. 350 coming in a couple weeks. Yeah, so really cool times. Um, and then uh, we actually, um, in 2020, there was a lot that was launched. Portals, Profits, uh, Profits Market Tracker, um, a lot of the, the mobile app, a lot of great stuff, inventory management. And then we also acquired Presses on, and that was kind of our start to the journey of um, offering pay-per-click tools. 2021, uh, we had 1 million members, which is quite a milestone. Um, Adtomic launched in May of 2020. So it's about a year since it's launched. Um, and we were, uh, you know, also first to market with Walmart tools. And that's something I'm really proud of. We've come a long way in the last year offering you some great value. Before we added those tools, everyone was flying blind, but we've got, you know, a lot of great data in order to help you with your Walmart businesses um, for, for Diamond members. Um, we also reached 200 team members in December of 2021. So we've got a lot of Helium 10 employees definitely growing. And then um, in January of 2022, we expanded our Serious Sellers podcast to German and Spanish, which really is helping to reach you know, a lot more sellers out there. Um, we had 700,000 users in our Chrome extension. So I think we're definitely the top Chrome extension out there, which is amazing. I mean, by far, we're the top. So um, and then in March, we reached 300 team members. So you can see Helium 10 growing exponentially. And then, you know, we have also just launched a bunch of new features today, as you can see. So we're going to be continuing to launch new tools, new features, and growing as fast as we can to give you all the value that um, you deserve as, as Amazon sellers. So that's kind of a walk down, this, down the memory lane, I guess. And I, I'm wondering, did anyone say that they've been around since 2016. If, I started in 2017. Were, guys, this was the web. I, I don't remember this. I wasn't around in 2016 for, for, for Helium 10. Like I didn't use yeah. Helium 10, but this was the, uh, I, I used the way back machine to find this. This was the very first login page for Helium 10. Does everybody remember this page here? This was the 2016 May uh, uh, Helium 10.com. This is what you would have seen back uh jake says helium 10 doubled members year over year so it took us five years from 2016 to 2021 to hit 1 million um having 1 million members and then from 2021 to 2022 now we hit our second million now now we've had 2 million uh members there so i don't think yeah. anybody remembers this page uh, let me let me show you guys the one that i came in this is the page that when i first got introduced to helium 10 in 2017 do you guys remember this login page where every time you went to it it would autoplay this like video for Manny. I was like, ah, oh, I got so annoyed of his voice after a while. I was like, every time I go to helium10.com, it autoplays this video. Ah, stop it, stop it. But this, <laughs> this is how I uh, I came to know Helium 10 for us from this, uh, from this page. Jake remembers that. Yep. Samir does too. I love it. Michelle remembers that one. Yep, yep. We all, we, a lot of us uh, came in on on this one. So, so because of this, we're commemorating this, this date uh, of our anniversary here. So, so what, what, what do we got, Carrie? We have so many great features that are launching on diamond and elite only. So, um, we actually wanted to give you a discount so that you can have access to those amazing features. Time savers, definitely worth it. Also an added amazing extra bonus is the first 20 people who sign up. We're going to, you're going to get a small group exclusive coaching session with helium 10 brand evangelists. So you're going to, you, get some amazing value. If you actually do it right now, you probably still have a chance to get in that top 20 spot. So definitely don't wait. Um, I highly recommend, especially if you're looking at Walmart tools, all the Walmart tools are only av available on diamond. And a lot of these amazing features are just diamond. So diamond is definitely the way to go. If you want all access to all of these amazing features. So Okay. All right. In just a little bit, guys, we're going to be able to ask, uh, answer some questions. So hopefully you guys wrote down your questions that you had about some of these 
uh, new launches. But if you notice about some of these new launches, some of them are only for like the Diamond and Elite. So if you're a Platinum already, this is a great time to take advantage. We've never offered this like six uh did you say six months six months yeah, six yeah. Months, good grief six it's a lot. months of 20 percent um off so if you're platinum already this also counts just to upgrade your diamond hey you want to try it out and you know what after after two months you're like you know what this is this is not my 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 vibe here like you can go ahead and go back to platinum you know no problem no problem at all um so so you're not going to know though if you're going to really find value in the diamond plant unless you give it a try and give atomic a try and give those listing uh, analyzer, new features to try, et cetera. So take advantage of this, guys. Helium10.com forward slash launch 20 to get six months off of Diamond or Platinum. If you guys are watching this on the replay next week or something, take a look at your, uh, take a look at your calendar because uh, after 5-23, May 23rd um, at midnight, it's no longer going to be uh, valid there. Uh, like I said before at the beginning, guys, this is not – uh, just a one-time thing, all right? This is not a one-time thing. We actually used to do this like once every quarter, you know, four times a year. No, every single month, I want you to be expecting this level of amazingness, all right? I mean, I, I get upset that this stupid microphone is connected to this because I just want to like drop the mic sometimes after <laughs> some of these these things here because, and that's what <laughs> I want you guys to, to expect next month. You know, we're trying to get bigger. We're trying to get better. And we will be every month with launching these new tools and features. Thus, that's why it's called the Bigger, Better Launch. So already mark your calendars. Put it in your Google Google Calendar right now. We don't have the link yet to register for it, but put this in your calendar to make sure that you guys uh, take this time out of your day. Uh, June 16th at 11 a.m. is Bigger, Better Launch version two coming up. So now um, if you guys have some questions that we weren't able to get to about one of these increase uh, about one of these uh, new launches, um, please let us know in the chat and we'll try and get to as many. We got about uh, five, six minutes. Um, or no, we got about like 10 minutes more. We can, um, uh, we can go here. So let us know of any questions. All right. Uh, Jake had a question, Carrie. Uh, does it show keywords already added to keyword tracker or will it show those results for all terms? You don't really um, the answer to that, I do. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's for all the terms that are in there. So, or in Keyword Tracker. Yeah. yeah so, you have to be, tracker. you have, uh, so that's why you saw in that screenshot that Carrie showed, there's a button for the one that wasn't and it says add to Keyword Tracker. So, then from then on, now you can see the, uh, the history on, on that. Sonia says, Can I use the discount if I already have an account? So, if you already got a platinum and you want to upgrade to uh, diamond, absolutely, you can use that. But if you have platinum, you just want to get an extra 20%. Um, no, this is only for new customers or if you're upgrading, you know, from free to platinum or from platinum to uh, diamond. Um, Where right, do you so, get business reports and profits? Somebody asked. Wait, did I miss that? Uh, that's or, what that's what somebody's asking. Um, where to get the it's on your profits dash dashboard in there. Oh, OK, yeah, yeah. Uh, the business reports um, you, you uh, yeah, it's on the uh, product performance tab in profits. So hit the product performance on the left-hand side, or if you have diamond or elite, you'll also see it on your just dashboard itself. Uh, Kobe had said, uh, can you please show how to find the atomic keyword tracker, how to use it for my, if my bids are enough. So, so what's, what's this, the logic again, if you can explain that again, Carrie, the logic behind why, why this is valuable to look at your bids and then look at where you're ranking in sponsored uh, ads. So uh, if you're already ranking at the top position for a keyword, then you don't need to raise your bid because you're already winning that spot. So, you know, that's definitely something to, to keep track of, to make sure that you're not over, you know, overbidding kind of thing. Cause it can, you know, eventually over time, the bids will just keep increasing. Um, so you want to, you know, just ma make sure that you're monitoring that where you're already at in a sponsored rank, um, to know whether or not your bids are good or not. So if you wanted to go higher, say you're not you know, ranking it on the top position and that's where you want to be, then you're going to need to raise your bid there. But if you, um, if you're already there, then your bid should be able to stay the same. You should be able to, um, to stay there. But, you know, over time, it will need to increase because you've got competition out there. So it's something that's going to help you monitor this in the in the dashboard. So you don't have to go back and forth. It'll make it a lot easier for you to see that um, it's available today for elite members. And then later on will be for diamond. So um, just want to clarify, if you're not seeing it right now, that's probably the situation. Um, it's elite today and then hmm. soon diamond. Okay. Fernando says automatic review requests, please. We got that already. Follow up. 
Fernando, you have access to follow-up. We have those automatic review requests right there in follow-up. All right, let's see here. It goes so fast. <laughs> Will the September event work for me? That I because I'm not yet selling on Amazon. Absolutely. You know, mm -hmm. it, this is not, it's not meant to be, oh, only if you're a seven figure seller, you're going to get a benefit from it. We'll, we'll have a lot of networking sessions for newer sellers. We're going to have a lot of information that's very relevant to brand new sellers, uh, at, equally to experienced sellers. So yes, uh, absolutely. It, you'd still find benefit in that conference, even if you're new. Lars has a suggestion about profit. Remember guys, where do you put your your suggestions in, you put your suggestions into that submit your feature uh, request uh, right there on your Helium 10 dashboard. Um, ah, ah, good question here. Ian said uh, this is, has I, I, don't, I really didn't want to answer stuff about that weren't about today, but this kind of is today because we were talking about the, the six year anniversary of Helium 10. But Ian says, what is the origin of the name Helium 10? So the original motto of Helium 10 from Manny and Geed, our founders, was we help sellers rise to the top. And so like a helium in a helium balloon helps somebody rise up. And so that's what Helium does. And then we give people 10 out of 10 service and 10 out of 10 tools, like uh, on a scale of 10 out of 10. So that's the origin of the Helium 10 name. Did you know, did you even know that Gary? No, I actually, I always just was like, cool, Helium 10. <laughs> cool. <laughs> nope, didn't know it. How much does it cost to become certified for Helium 10 tools? It's, I believe it's $77 uh, yes, yes. in there. So, so to use Academy, it's free. But if you want to do that certification, it's like a carry set, $77. Where do I find the Adtomics Bootcamp? So that is on that page that we, um, maybe we can go back to that Adtomic page on the presentation maybe um, to show that URL, but right. definitely um, go in and sign up for that. Um, where is it? Somebody put have... the link there. I, I don't know if I can go all the way back there. Okay. Somebody will put the link uh, for you um, in the chat, but if you guys can't find it, ju just reach out to support at helium10.com and, and they'll give you the link directly or sign you up directly too. Uh, Sam says for the estimated brand value, can I exclude non-private label sales? Yeah. A lot of people have been asking for that. That'll, you know, make sure to make your voice heard, uh, in, in the feature request. Um, but yeah, you would, you would definitely need to do that. And by the way, you know, if you're a wholesale seller or an arbitrage seller, you know, obviously that's not going to apply to you. You know, you don't sell those accounts for in the same way that you do a private label account, but yeah, make sure to uh, Sam to, to put that request uh, in. Someone asked, what's the difference between freedom ticket and Academy? Great so. Question. Um, the Academy is going to be an in-depth instruction about how to use Helium 10 tools. So you're going to be a tools expert and it's really, really, you know, good to know the ins and outs of tools so you can implement strategies, right? Freedom Ticket is going to give you a more of how to sell on Amazon in general and lots of really great strategies. Um, it's really, really detailed. It's literally the best a to Z course on how to start your business on Amazon and how to launch products. So it gives you more the Amazon aspect of it as well. Um, is there anything you would add Bradley to that? No, but I mean, yeah, Freedom Ticket, A to Z guys on Walmart and Amazon. Uh, actually, not much Helium 10 uh, is in there, uh, you know, a very small percentage. But in Academy, it's 100% about how to use the Helium 10 tools in order to grow your Amazon or Walmart business. So so they're com they're, they're, they're different, uh, different uh, lanes for sure. Um, David says, hey, uh, I tried to use the coupon not available for annual plans. Yes, this is only for the month-to-month -month plans for six months since it's, since it's a six-month um, coupon. See, uh, Linda says, good information. Glad I was able to be on. Thank you very much, Linda. Could you add automation to Atomic that it would chase the first place? That sounds like a feature request, all right? So, I mean, if, if you're one of the ones who uses the automation inside of Atomic um, and you want to integrate that there, then make sure to, make sure to submit that to our team, Tony. Tony, a great suggestion there. Um, a lot of the new, uh, Satig says, do they work for Amazon EU? A lot of it, a lot of what we talked about. Yes, absolutely works for uh, Amazon uh, EU. The Chrome extension, uh, you know, Academy, the freedom ticket, etc.
do I need Diamond Plan to use Listing Builder? No, you don't. Um, Uh, if they meant listing analyzer, which is what we were talking about today, you don't, but for the special, like the, the media comparison and also the kind of like uh, detailed product information, those two features, you do need the, the diamond plan. It's so hard to scroll through. Uh, like Zoom needs to get a better way to scroll through comments. Yeah, it's so it's, hard it's, when there's so many. It's hard. <laughs> uh, will a recorded video link be sent to us of today's presentation? Yes. Yes, Corey, it will. Someone said just learning PPC so I can get Helium 10. Oh, okay, where'd it go? Helium 10 for all my PPC needs, correct? Yes. Uh, it says I can have my VA learn everything, right? Yes, you can have your VA sign up for that boot camp, and that's going to help uh, tremendously. We also have learn buttons and a lot of great um, information in our academy and on our actual tools themselves when you hit the learn button. So uh, have them sign up for the boot camp, and that will help them tremendously. Gerardo says I took advantage of a 10% discount. Can you help me get the 20% for six months? I honestly wouldn't do that if I were you, Gerardo, because the 10% discount, if you got in on that, that's a lifetime deal. So, um, you know, unless you plan on stopping to sell on Amazon, you know, in nine months or so, you might have a, a, a good deal there if you got the lifetime 10% uh, off, if you're only talking about platinum and not the, not the diamond there. So I, I would stick with the one that you have, Gerardo. Um, would you explain again about listing analyzer about pictures? So what? Uh, go to h10listings.com. That's one of our listing optimization webinars where we explain the concept. And, and that webinar had nothing to do with listing analyzer because we didn't have listing analyzer doing this. But it talks about the concept of looking at your competitors' pictures and trying to see if there's certain themes that multiple sellers are all doing that they have found effective and then that you should try and emulate with your um, with, with your listings as well. And then Chelsea just sent a reminder here for submitting new features. You click the question icon on the top and then click share your ideas. So that's what it's called the button, share your ideas. Uh, Elizabeth says Helium is mainly for our own brand, but can it be used for arbitrage as well? Most of the features we talked about today is mainly for, for private label. But if you're talking about other Helium 10 tools, absolutely. Uh, we, we have, uh, hundreds, hundreds, if not thousands of arbitrage sellers who use Helium 10 as well. Um, and then it's asked, they asked about, um, is Helium 10 useful for products that aren't sold on Amazon at all? Yes, we have Walmart uh, mm -hmm. tools for Walmart, um, but you can also utilize our Amazon tools to find products that are in demand. If you wanted to build your own website, it's a great way to, to see demand because most people are shopping on Amazon. It'll give you literally the best data that available to determine whether or not there's demand for the product that you want to sell. So yes, you can use it literally for any e-commerce or any, even if you wanted to go to retail with something. Alma says, I started Freedom Ticket 2.0, but now I see there's 3.0. Should I continue with the latest? Yeah, I, I, I would uh, jump to 3.0 because it's it has the most updated information because, you know, things on Amazon change. And that's why we have version one, two, and three, because we, we try and keep up with all the changes on Amazon. John said, uh, is the offer 20% also good for German customers? Absolutely. Where do I find the opportunity board in Helium 10? If you're, I'm not sure if what you're talking about, if that one click opportunity, um, opportunity product that we talked about today, if so, that is in Cerebro towards the top of the page after you enter a multiple ASIN search. Are the tools for Walmart included now on the platinum membership or is it charged separately? So all the Walmart tools are included in the diamond membership. You have limited usage and, you know, just to see what they're about in platinum. But if you want access to Walmart tools, that's the diamond plan. All right, maybe one more we can find and then we're going to sign off here. But again, you guys, if you have questions about the, the specials today, if you have questions about how to use a tool, we're going to have videos up for all of these new features, uh, hopefully by, by Monday, but we have 24, uh, 24 hour seven customer support. So there's a chat button on the bottom, right? You can reach out to support at any time and to get help with the, uh, with the tools. Uh, Steven, I was having a trouble uh, with signing up for the atomic blast off. So if you think that it didn't go through, just reach out to support.
just reach out to support Steven and they'll make sure you're, you're signed up for it. But somebody, uh, if there's an atomic or customer service person on this call, if you guys could take a look at that, what happens after you click, um, after you enter the d details, if there is an error message, maybe we can get that fixed for people. Uh, Mark says, I have a platinum plan. Can I switch a diamond and get 20%? Absolutely. Yeah. So if you have platinum now, you can, you can use the same, the same link here and say upgrade to diamond, get 20% off those six months. If at any time you like decide that it's not for you, just go right back to platinum. No, no problem. All right. That's about it. If you guys have extra questions, please reach out to customer service and we will be happy to help you guys. I hope you guys are as pumped as we are about these new bigger and better launches that we've been doing on tools and features. Make sure to uh, get ready for our next month one, which will be June 16th at 11 a.m. Pacific time. Carrie, thank you so much for joining us. Despite yes. your audio issues, you got it worked out there. So thank we're you. happy you got it uh, taken <laughs> care of. And please go take care of your dog now. Um, she's very <laughs> upset uh, that you've taken that, all this time away. Doorbell. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you so much. Have a Thanks. great rest of your day. Bye.